I'm okay. Well, it's been about a week since I have put this feeder up, so I'm gonna climb up and uh, open the lid up and see how much corn they've uh, actually ate out of it. I don't think they have eaten a whole lot. Um, I came up a couple times last week to check and they're just a little bit skittish right now about coming up and eating out of the funnels. I did throw some corn out on the ground, they ate that, um, but checking my trail cam uh, pictures, they're just a little bit shy about coming around. It usually takes couple days to get them used to coming up and eating out of the feeder but for some reason um, out here where the where it's sitting right now it's just i don't know they're just a little bit skittish about it okay this thing has four sides to it but the one thing i did do i clogged up two sides and the reason why i did is because normally these deer will eat this whole 600 pound feeder in one day, I'm sorry, in one week. And I wanted to slow them down, so I clogged those up. But I'm not sure that, I don't know if that's spooking them. Because I'm telling you, they will eat this whole container in a week, easy. So I'm going to, I'm going to take the, bags out so they can have access to all four funnels i don't know if it's that white that's spooking them don't know but something's doing it because these deer shouldn't be that spooked so we'll see what happens if that helps but it is mid-January. Well, it's not mid-January. Yeah, mid-January just about. And it's cold. 
polar vortex is in. So these deer should be, they should be feeding heavily. Um, there's a very, very small acre crop this year. So the deer are, are hungry. I mean, you can see, you can see here where I've been throwing some loose corn out on the ground. I mean, it's just, there's just tracks everywhere. There's not a lot around the feeder. So I don't know, we'll see what happens. Hopefully in the next day or two, they will come in here and start eating because I know they're hungry. <laughs> 